Hi, everyone. This is David Cochran. I'm with my good friends and colleagues, Pamela Gallagher and Owner Dosher. And the three of us are speaking at the Affiliated Schools Conference being sponsored by ESAR in November. So we are three of the 10 speakers. We all have schools of astrology. We're going to say a few things about what we're going to speak about. We'll tell you a little bit about our schools. So Pam, start us off. Tell us about you know, what you're going to speak on and a little bit about your School of Astrology. Hi, I'm Pam Gallagher, and I'm the founder and director of the Midwest School of Astrology in Cincinnati, Ohio. We are an actual brick and mortar school. We own our own building. We have a great library. It's an exciting place because we have a community. And in the United States, we're it. So I'm excited to be part of this first um, ESAR affiliated school conference. We've never done anything where the schools came together. I find it terribly exciting because we all have our own niche in the astrology world and we've all paid our dues. So we've been around a while. So I will be speaking on this weekend about the natal chart and all of the options that you can put in the natal chart. We start with the basic and then of course there's a lot of add-ons. And so we'll be talking about those add-ons and where they come from and what is their history. So I'm excited to be talking about our level one at the Midwest School of Astrology. We start every year in the fall and we go through June. We do have some weekends with the speakers that come in so that you're welcome to join those even before the school year starts. Owner, I'd love to hear about your program and what you're doing in Turkey. <laughs> Hi, great things from Istanbul, Turkey, and you know I'm the founder of Astro School of Astrology, and I'm sure people are very excited to join this wonderful conference where the respected head teachers ESAR, of the ESAR affiliated astrology schools will be presenting with high quality lectures and workshops. So I'm sure people are very sure that they will learn a lot about traditional and modern astrological techniques. Astro School of Astrology is founded in 2005 and from the 2015 affiliated school of ESAR. And in this conference, I will teach about how to use the traditional and modern pr uh, prediction techniques together. And prediction techniques of traditional astrology have a great contribution to astrology with a high accuracy rate and can be used together with the new trends of the modern astrology predictive techniques. So I will teach many uh, traditional techniques such as propactions, periodaria, directing by terms, ages of man. Then I will combine them with uh, solar and lunar returns, secondary progressions, and transits. So I'm very excited about this. And what do you teach, David? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so I will. I am going to speak about zodiac signs. The the most basic thing we hear about, you know, from day one in astrology, zodiac signs. Well, what we do in the system of astrology that I do, vibrational astrology, is we like to do research. We go through databases. We see what's going on. Compare it to what happens with our clients. And a lot of people have this feeling, well, research, you know, that's a lot of statistics and very boring and dry, but it's not. It's, it's a lot of fun. And we've come up with ideas of what the zodiac signs mean, which is very similar to what you're familiar with, but not exactly the same. And so we're going to show you these new insights into the most basic, fundamental thing we learn about zodiac signs. So that's what I'll be speaking about, what we've found, what we discovered, how it can help you understand what's going on, why sometimes a Leo is not proud, a Libra is not indecisive, a Scorpio is not intense. It happens. It happens a lot. We'll, you know, we'll look into why that happens. And so our my school of astrology is, is online. Our next classes start in, in January. Um, and we have an intensive program. I accept only up to 10 people. And I will be teaching for owner's school as well in Turkish, who translated, um, as well as my own programs. I've got a lot of teaching coming up. So that's it, my friends. Three of the 10 of us who are speaking, different schools of astrology, different approaches, of course, a lot of overlap. And one of the things you might notice 
if you haven't sensed it already, is what great friends Owner Pam and I are and how we work. I've been to both of their schools. I love what they do. They love what I do. And we're all digging for what's going on with astrology through all this heritage. It's so exciting to get together with people from different perspectives. And that's what the conference is all about. People, as I like what you said, Pam, we paid our dues. <laughs> you know, we we've all, all 10 speakers have been in this, dedicating our lives to it and coming up with really cool, interesting things. So we all will learn. Speakers will learn, the attendees, doesn't matter if you're a beginner, a pro. We learn because we're all investigating and developing. So that's it, Pam. Do you want to say anything? And then owner, closing remarks. I'd just like to say that the conference is the 19th and 20th of November. It's going to be oh. online. And you can go to the ESAR website and read all about it and sign up for it. And we really hope you come and play with us because we're going to have a fun weekend. <laughs> we're, looking for, we're looking for people that love astrology like we do. I can tell you that many years ago, a very ancient, a, a famous astrologer said to me, I didn't pick astrology, astrology picked me. Yeah. And I believe that. Come play with us. <laughs> <laughs> Owner, have the last word, my friend. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm really, very excited about this conference because this will be the first one. And, you know, I hope everyone can attend who are in this astrology world. So looking forward, very excited. <laughs> okay, beautiful. Thank you so much. We're going to sign off. Hope to see you all there. Take care. God bless. Namaste.